Children do stupid things all the time. They steal and lie and bite and scream. But by far the most hurtful thing a child can do to their mother is abandon them. That is a true sign when a parent knows they have failed. One in seven kids between the ages of 10 and 18 will run away at some point. And there are one to three million runaway and homeless kids living on the streets in the United States. Every day, it's the same. I wake up, get dressed, go to school, come home to do homework, text my best friend Charlie, eat dinner, wash the stars, do the dishes, go to sleep, rinse, and repeat. Hey, Charlie, wanna grab a bite to eat after school? Oh, uh, you know, I would love to, Meg, but Emily and I are on some uneven ground right now, and she doesn't like how much time we spend together. But, you know, once this whole jealousy thing blows over, I'm sure we can go get pizza or something. But, as of right now, it's like, the only person I can talk to, you know, or, I'm sure you understand. Oh, yeah, no, I, I get it. It's just that, you know, I have something really important that I want to talk to you about. Something that I've been considering for a while. Charles! Hey, dumpling. Because she's my friend. That's it. She's not a threat to you. So why don't you just let this whole thing go? If you leave me here for her, we're over. So, what was it you wanted to tell me? Oh! Um, I just have something that's been on my mind for a while. I've been thinking about it a lot. I didn't just come up with it in my sleep or anything. And I figured that I should tell you, considering you're probably my only friend. You're scaring me right now. Right, I'm sorry, I'll just... Charlie, I'm leaving town. What? I can't live here anymore like this. It's suffocating me. I, My mom is all over me. My dad gets mad at us for literally everything. And then there's school. I'm sorry that you're my only friend, and it's not your fault that I'm not yours. But you never have time for me. I just can't sit around and imagine what life would be like if I were someone else. You have a life here. You have a future. You have Emily. You really need to make things up with her because she loves you a lot. Okay? All right. At least promise me you know what you're doing. seven children decide to run away. But sometimes these children find a reason to turn around. They realize that although nobody has to stay, 